Welcome to Plathville's Kim Plath has been called out for her selfish behavior through the years, but she needs to stop blaming her now ex-daughter-in-law for the issues that she's been dealing with forever. Kim, who has been sharing the details of her divorce from Barry Plath on Welcome to Plathville Season 6, has been having a hard time re-establishing herself after her divorce. While Kim has been doing her best to keep her head above water and parent her three young daughters, the rest of the Plath family has been noticing that she's not doing well after her split. Kim's behavior has become more erratic and irregulated the longer she's been featured on Welcome to Plathville. Though the show was originally meant to be a look into the lives of the former fundamentalist family as they faced modernity, the series has changed over the years. With the Plath kids growing up on camera and still struggling to reintegrate into society in some ways, there have been a lot of growing pains for both the younger Plaths and the older ones through the years. Kim, rather than taking accountability for her side of things, has always had Olivia to blame. Related 20 Best Reality TV Shows Right now Reality TV is more popular than ever. With so many to choose from, here are some of the best reality TV shows to stream or watch right now. Kim Plath feels Olivia's to blame for her issues she doesn't realize she's at fault close although Kim and her family have all tried to share that they're responsible for their own issues, Kim doesn't believe that her problems stemmed from herself. Instead, she's taken to blaming Olivia, her son Ethan's ex-wife, for her problems. Kim seems to believe that her problems didn't start until Ethan and Olivia were married, which she pushed for heartily when the pair were both just 20 years old. Hopeful that her son would be able to start a new life and take her along, Kim was disheartened when Ethan and Olivia's marriage was something they wanted to be for them. While Kim pushed for the couple to marry, she didn't like the way it turned out and quickly decided that she didn't want that for Ethan. Unhappy with how she perceived Olivia to act toward Ethan, Kim tried to poison the well with the rest of her family about her daughter-in-law. Kim was angry that Olivia tried to push Ethan to think for himself, advocate for himself, and choose new paths. Rather than working to understand her son's marriage, Kim made others dislike Olivia, publicly slandered her, and then didn't understand when Ethan chose to go no contact with his family. Kim's actions have shown she's selfish self-destructive she's not acting like she's stable while Kim has been able to talk through the issues she's had both on and off welcome to Plathville, the actions she's displayed over the years have been selfish and sometimes self-destructive. Kim's behavior has made her children second-guess their relationships with her, and likely played a hand in the split between herself and Barry. From taking Ethan's credit cards and using them without his permission or understanding to her traumatic DUI arrest, Kim's behavior has shown that she isn't the most trustworthy member of the Plath family, especially to the kids she's still in charge of caring for. Kim's most recent self-destructive issue has been her DUI arrest, which she has since gone to court, paid a fine, and performed community service to repent for. The issue with Kim being arrested for driving under the influence is less about the fact that it happened and more about the fact that Kim doesn't appear to realize just how destructive her behavior has been. Rather than taking accountability for her actions, Kim has been focused on the way others have made her feel about the issue, including Olivia. Instead of focusing on herself, Kim has placed her anger on others. Kim's relationships with her family have been crumbling for years she hasn't had her children's support while Kim's relationship with Olivia wasn't good, her relationships with her children have been on a downhill spiral for years before things heated up with Ethan's ex. Though Kim has been a good mother to her children at times, 
Her behavior has made many of the older Plath children question her motives and struggle to understand where she's coming from. Kim has been selfish in nature with Mariah Plath in her music ventures and Micah Plath in his modeling career, but always tries to do her best to square away their relationships before anything can go too far against her. Though Kim has the support of her younger daughters for the most part, her issues have been focused on the fact she doesn't always have her older kids on her side. With Mariah often pushing Kim away so she doesn't feel like her mother is taking the attention while Micah has made himself scarce around the family for years, Kim's relationship with Ethan has been the toughest to recover. After cutting her out because of Olivia, Kim's relationship with Ethan seems to be slowly rebuilding, but it hasn't found itself resurrected in the way she'd like after some difficult work. Kim can't take accountability for her own faults she can't look inward welcome to Plathville's Kim has been able to assess her own issues, but doesn't ever take accountability for them as she moves through her life. While Kim and Olivia have had their issues, Olivia has already started moving on with her life away from the Plaths. Though she's had some issues with Kim, Olivia has recognized that she can't heal if she's dwelling on the past and her relationship with Kim is better left there. Happy to be moving forward, Olivia seems to feel better about the situation while Kim is still angry about a relationship that wasn't even hers. With Kim stuck in the past, her issues with Olivia are still incredibly present in her mind as she moves into the next phase in her life. Though she's been able to reconcile with Ethan in some ways, she's still working toward fixing her relationship with her eldest son. Even so, her relationship with Ethan and the rest of her children likely won't be something she can fix while she's still fixated on blaming Olivia for her shortcomings. Instead of focusing on Olivia, the Welcome to Plathville star should be trying to look within herself to try and move forward. Welcome to Plathville airs Tuesdays at 10 p.m. Eastern Daylight Saving Time on TLC. Source, TLC, Instagram Welcome to Plathville 3-year rating 5 stars 4. 5 stars 4 stars 3.5 stars 3 star 2.5 stars 2 stars 1.5 stars 1 stars 0.5 star rate now submit rate now edit leave a review your comment has not been saved tvpg reality welcome to plathville is a reality television series that follows the lives of the plath family a strongly conservative family with nine children that while sharing some of their values have begun to yearn for and seize their own independence As the family tries to hold on to their old world values, primarily separated from the rest of the country, they will reckon with their children's newfound beliefs and clash with new family members from their spouses. Cast Barry Plath, Kim Plath, Ethan Plath, Olivia Plath, Micah Plath, Mariah Plath, Nathan Meggs, Lydia Meggs release date November 5, 2019 Season 6 Streaming Services Hulu, HBO Max Directors Deborah Ridpath Main Genre Reality Expand See at Amazon.